Hello everyone, today I'm doing a meal of the day and I'm going to be making, um, well I call it chicken taco pasta. So there's no recipe for it because I made it up. Anyways, um, so what I'm using is, um, I got chicken and this is like, um, like one and a half pounds of chicken. And then I got um, mixed vegetables from like the freezer, the freezer section, I just warmed them up cook them and then um yeah they have like broccoli carrots red pepper onions mushrooms and stuff in there and then um the the the, the um the vegetables had um onions in it but i like a lot of onions so i kind of i cut up some onions and to add my own and then i got um the chicken taco seasoning pasta um Cajun seasoning to add, black pepper, um, your trusty curry powder, yes, um, and I got a can of tomato paste and then salt, and that's it. I might add more ingredients, but I'll tell you, and then I got my pot for cooking the chicken and the vegetables and onions, and then this pot is for the pasta. So, I already cut the chicken, already cut my onions so I'm going to put oil in the pan and then start cooking the tomatoes no not tomatoes the onions and the chicken so yeah okay so I put the um, the tomato paste in a bowl and then I'm going to add um, the top the chicken taco seasoning mix um, the Cajun seasoning the black pepper the curry powder a little bit of salt and some water to make a sauce. Okay, so while I'm making my sauce, I'm going to start um, sauteing my onions. So they'll cook a little bit and then I'm going to add my chicken. Okay, so my onions have browned a little bit. So I'm going to add the chicken now so that um, my onions don't get too brown before I add the chicken and stuff. So yeah. Okay, so I added the chicken. And I will let that cook while I'm making my sauce. And I have the um, stove at between like six and seven. So yeah. So I'm gonna let that cook, and I'm finished making my sauce. Okay, so um, my sauce. I told you I added tomato paste, so I added tomato paste. And then I added um, one teaspoon of my um, Cajun seasoning, and then one teaspoon of my curry powder, and then several shakes of my black pepper, and then like a little bit of salt, and then I put a cup of water, and then I just mix it together, I just kept stirring it so everything matches together, and that will be my sauce. Um, I might add more water once I mix it with the chicken, but for now, I'll just keep it like this. Okay, so my chicken is fully cooked with the onions, and now I'm going to add my sauce. Okay, so I just dumped the sauce in. Now let me mix it all together. And I haven't changed, um, I mean, okay, so I turned down the heat a little bit to six. And now I'm just mixing all the, the sauce with the chicken together. So now, while I'm waiting for this to, um, to cook, I'm going to um, start cooking my pasta. Okay, so I added um, an, like a half cup of water to my chicken and sauce mix just to make it a little less thick. And I'm going to continue to let that cook. Um, right now it's 9.03, so I, I said, um, so I put this in like a minute ago, um, well not 9.04, so I'm going to say I put, um, I put my sauce together at 9.02, and then I will let this cook for some time, and then when I feel like it's enough, I'll see how long I cooked it for. Okay, so I've been like cooking this at, um, 6 for like 5 minutes now. So I'm going to turn it down 
to like three and then let that simmer a bit my water is ready for pasta oh, nice and bubbly okay so I've added my vegetable mix in with the sauce and the chicken and I still have my uh, my stove at number um, at level three so yeah so I'm just gonna let this cook some more in here kind of simmer kind of thing not really cook anymore so yeah so all the vegetables are in here chicken and sauce um, I might add some water well, actually, the water that I used to, cause um, the vegetables were like frozen vegetables, so the wa and like uh, the water I used to to cook it in the microwave, I just dumped the rest of it in there. So that's probably like a fourth cup of water. I might add some more water if it's really thick, but we'll see. Okay, so right now it's 9:15, and I started, and I put my chicken. Remember, I put my chicken and my sauce at 9:02, 9:03 ish. And then now it's my 15. Um, I turn my um, my um, the stove down to two, and then I'm just still letting this simmer in the pot. Um, I, I try not to mix um, the the like the sauce too much or too heavy, so not to like break up, you know, like make the the vegetables all soggy and like break up and stuff like that. So. It smells really good, and I add a little more, more salt, just for taste. Um, everyone has their own salt level, so you can give or take salt as you please, but I put a little bit more salt. It's a really thin thin layer over the, the sauce, not too much. And my pasta should be done pretty soon. Okay, the time now is 9.18, and I feel like the sauce is done cooking so I'm going to turn the the stove off and just let it sit there even though it's still going to be hot I'll just let it sit there and it's still bubbling and stuff like that so oh my gosh it smells so good I cannot wait to eat this now the pasta should be done in like two minutes okay so my pasta is done cooking I cooked it um all the way through the directions on the box and then now it's complete now I can dish up my food and start chowing down okay so this is the final product and this is my chicken taco pasta and I'm so ready it's all piping hot look at it look at it 